The area's three MLAs opened their campaign office on Sunday afternoon, but what one MLA announced at the grand opening was a surprise to many. Party faithful were on hand at the campaign office on Victoria Street, but when the MLA for Prince George Mackenzie took to the podium, it was not what many in the room expected to hear. I'm announcing today that I'm withdrawing my name as the candidate for the Prince George uh, North, Prince George Mackenzie riding as a BC Liberal. It's called a pulmonary aneurysm and it is extremely rare. Discovered in mid-December, Bell says the past two months have been agonizing. The last couple of months have been really tough, you know. First of all, just trying to make the decision. What do I do? Do I stay on? Do I uh, take another term knowing already that uh, you know, I may have health challenges going into that term? Uh, or do I step aside? Uh, for me, thinking first of all about family and my own personal health, you, know, you, you kind of have to step aside on the other hand. However, he has committed to stay on as cabinet minister until the May election, unless his health worsens. He and Prince George Valmont MLA Shirley Bond have been side by side for a dozen years. The news was tough to hear. Well, I think any time you lose a senior cabinet minister of Pat's stature, um, that is a loss. And, you know, we have some significant individuals leaving the team. Uh, but all of us recognize that health and family come first and there is not a hesitation knowing Pat's uh, medical condition. I just want him to be healthy and have a long life ahead and that's so important to me. With the announcement, the BC Liberals will spend the coming days selecting a new candidate to run in the May election and quickly. Our core campaign teams have been uh, you know, working hard and, and so in essence I don't have uh, one hesitation. I know that the, uh, the process will be done quite quickly I imagine as we roll out the details in the next few days. But there are campaign races taking place across the province as we speak and this will just be another one of them. Obviously a little more personal for me in this case uh, than some of the others. Bell says this is not how he wanted to leave politics but says his time has come. But he cautions against thinking he will simply disappear. If you'd had to ask me 14 years ago uh, what I would be doing, uh, I wouldn't have told you that it would have been politics. I, it was never part of my life plan. Uh, I very much enjoyed it. I hope I've been able to contribute in a small way to Prince George and to Mackenzie. I hope I've been able to leave a bit of a legacy behind. So I don't know what's going to be in the, around the next corner for Pat Bell. Uh, I'll tell you when I get there. Cheryl Jan, CKPG News.